Join Kids Hat Family. Hey Bill, can you please do my science project? I am very busy. Sure, Tofu. If only you give me some reward. I will bring you lots of chocolates. Yay! Thanks. Hi Bill. Thanks for the science project. Can you do my maths homework? I don't feel so well. Ah, okay. But what do I get this time? Um, you get more chocolates from me and maybe a treat at the nearest fast food joint? Wow, that sounds perfect. You will get your maths homework tomorrow. Thanks, Bill. See you tomorrow. Hi, chap. Have you seen Bill around? Hey, he is on sick leave for about two weeks. The doctor has advised him to get complete bed rest. Oh no, my maths homework. And what about my next homework? I will have to do it on my own. How would I do it? Come on kids, submit your math workbooks now. Good morning Miss Ellie. I am sorry, I left my math workbook at home today. Well, that's not an acceptable excuse Tofu. Your punishment is to submit the next four exercises from the workbook tomorrow. But Miss Ellie, I'm sorry. No excuses Tofu. Get back to your seat now. Tofu, why are you crying? What happened? Tia, I used to reward Bill for doing my projects and homework. But now he is on sick leave. How would I do it on my own? It is a lot of hard work and I don't know how to do my homework. But Tofu, that is such a bad habit. You shouldn't have given all your projects and homework to Bill. You are running away from responsibilities and hard work. You will never learn anything if you continue with this habit of yours. I am sorry Tia, please help me out. You reminded me of a story. Come on, hear me out. The Lazy Beggar In a small town nearby, there lived a kind fisherman named Finn. He was a generous and a hard-working man. Every day, he woke up early and went to work. And later, in the evening, he would come and sell fish in the market and earn lots of dimes. One fine day, as the fisherman was on his way to work, he was stopped by a beggar. Oh, generous man, spare me a few dimes. I haven't had a grain of food in the past few days. Here you go, my friend. The next day, Finn was again stopped by the beggar. Oh, generous man, spare me a few dimes. I am hungry. Here you go, eat well. And the next day, Finn was stopped by the beggar yet again. But this time, Finn had an idea that the beggar was just lazy. He was a perfectly healthy man and he could get any job if he worked hard enough. My friend, here are a few dimes for today. But I have a greater reward for you if you come by the river to meet me tomorrow morning. A reward? Tomorrow morning? Ah, oh, okay, I'll be there. Next day, as the sun rises, the beggar wakes up with excitement in search of a greater reward. To the fisherman's surprise, the beggar was already there by the river before the fisherman arrived. Oh, hello there. You are here before time. I like the spirit, young man. Good morning. Here, throw this fishnet in the river and wait for your reward. 
What kind of a reward is this? Well, the reward isn't here yet. You will have to wait. Oh, uh, okay. The beggar throws the fish net in the river and paces up and down impatiently by the shore. Finn carefully watches his behavior and says the next thing. Hey, take it easy. Be patient. Come, sit down with me. Is this what you do every day? Don't you get frustrated working so hard and waiting so long by the river? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh no, my friend. I give my best and wait patiently every day. The reward and contentment that I get later is worth it all. Oh look, you can now pull back the fishing net to the shore. The beggar jumps with excitement and pulls the fishing net towards him. He is stunned when he notices that the fishing net is filled with dozens of healthy fish. And here is the reward that you waited so patiently for. You can now go to the market and sell it off to earn some dimes. You don't have to beg anymore. If you worked hard for yourself and not be lazy. Oh kind man, I get the whole point of this now. Thank you so much for teaching me such an important lesson. Wow, that was an awesome story Tia. I feel like I let my laziness overcome my patience and ability to work hard. Good job boy, you got this. For your favorite rhymes, stories and more, join Kids Hat family. Subscribe here.